linear measuring instruments so first of all what is a linear measurement measurement of length diameter height even thickness can be comes under can be called as a linear measurement so to measure these parameters we have different measurement measuring instruments so those are called linear measuring instruments so these linear measuring instruments are classified into two types we can say so those are direct measuring instruments and indirect measuring instruments so the direct measuring instruments means like the quantity or any of these parameters can be determined directly so those are called a direct measuring instruments if these parameters are not able to determine directly so we have to find uh, calculate some external parameter from that parameter we will get these uh, uh, these parameters so that that time we will call it as indirect measuring instruments for example if we use any optical instruments so to measure a length of anything so that will comes under indirect measuring uh, indirect measuring instrument so in direct measuring instruments we will have two types so one is graduated measuring instruments and non graduated okay so let's see what are these graduated and non graduated measuring instruments in this tutorial we are going to focus on these direct measuring instruments only because these are the mechanical means uh, in indirect measuring instruments we uh, uh, the optical uh, measuring instruments will comes so that's why we are going to focus on direct measuring instruments only okay these are the graduated measuring instruments so graduated means like we will have a graduated scale on the measuring instruments you can see that this is a scale which is having graduate graduated uh, graduates on that scale to measure any uh, length of object so this is vernier caliper also having a main scale and vernier scale and this is dial indicator and this is vernier depth gauge and this is vernier height gauge and this is micrometer screw gauge can call it as simply micrometer or screw gauge so because this has a screw uh, as a principle uh, a nut and screw principle so that's why it is called as screw gauge and this is also uh, a screw gauge which is used to uh, measure the whole diameters so it is for internal measurements this is only for external measurements so this is what my uh, screw gauge for depth measurements screw gauge for depth measurements okay so these are all graduated measuring instruments so let's see what are the non graduated measuring instruments these are all the non -gradu graduated measuring instruments this is what a caliper with fixed joint this is also a caliper with fixed joint this will uh, this is used to measure ex uh, internal uh, diameters or some uh, anything like that and this is used to measure the external uh, uh, measurements and these are called uh, these are having uh, springs these are also calipers and this is what trammel 
so this trammel is used to draw arcs on sheets mostly this instrument is used in sheet metal sheet metal works so this is what trammel this is what trammel heads so these are the things we can see that so this is what a telescope gauge this is used to this is having two uh, plung, uh, plungers so which which is used to measure uh, the internal diameters of holes okay so this is what a surface gaze used to uh, draw the scribble the parallel lines and to mostly it is used to find the center point of any cylinder while uh, while we are going to use that cylinder on lathe works okay so this is used to scribble parallel lines so this is surface gaze and here you can see that this is straight edge this is also similar to that scale or steel rule without graduate so that's why it comes under non graduated instruments this is what wire gauge wire gauge which is having a notches along the ed uh, ed edge so which is having marked with the wire sizes which is used to measure the wire diameter and this is what uh, screw pitch gauges so screw pitch gauge used to measure the pitch of any screws and this is radius and fillet gauges and fillet and these are slip gauges okay so so this is thickness gauge so these are the different graduated and non graduated measuring instruments and the so that's all about linear measuring instruments thanks for watching hope you like this video please subscribe to our channel and please plus press the bell icon so that you will get updated when we post a new video thanks